There was one particular incident when you were beaten up properly. Mm, yeah. Tell me about that. Yeah, I was in, uh, I was in Rat Mines. Uh, I guess I was 18 at the time, and we were, uh, it was me and my girlfriend, and we were, we, we, we were with a crowd, but we got left behind. And we were walking down Rat Mines, and, and I saw uh, a guy getting a bit of a pasting. And we walked past him initially, and then I stopped, and I said, I can't do this. And I, I went back. Now, what would have been sensible would have been just to go into maybe the guard station, which was only across the road, but I wasn't thinking that straight, and I jumped in. Um, unfortunately, it didn't end like the, the martial arts movies where, you know, you drop three or four guys and you walk <laughs> off into the sunset. Yeah. I got fairly, <laughs> I was the one that got dropped. Um, thankfully, the guy got up and he, he ran, which, which was a natural instinct. I, yeah. I wouldn't have held that, that against him. That was decent of him, yeah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have held that against him no. um, at all. Um, but, but after, that, the, after yeah. that day, like I had, you know, there was physical scars. I, I, got, I got fairly beat up. But it was the mental side of it, you know, getting beat up in front of your girlfriend like that for a young man was, was very, very tough to deal with. It may sound like a ridiculous follow-on question, but why? Tell me about that. There's just a humiliation that goes with it, you know. The physical side wasn't all that bad, um, but, but the humiliation of being beaten up in front of your girlfriend. Like, I grew up watching, you know, uh, Bruce Lee movies and, and Rocky movies, and it was always like the, the strong macho guy could protect his woman, and I wasn't able to do that. And I didn't want to go out at <clears throat> I was at least six or nine months before I left that, the house that after long. that. It was, I went into, you know, kind of depression, I guess. And I decided it was... What was I going to do about this? Was I going to live inside forever or, or do what? And I start looking into martial arts. I start researching styles to learn how to defend myself. And, and that's how I came across uh, the UFC, mixed martial arts.